Well, as you know, Peter appeared many times on the Lyric stage over many years and always had a very strong connection with the theatre and as did the community around him. So it was one of his wishes that when he died that he would be um, seen here in some shape or, or, or form and, and we're delighted to have this funeral or this celebration of his life at the theatre. Life is a cabaret old chum. Come to the cabaret. Put down the knitting, the book and the broom. It's time for a holiday. Life is a cabaret old chum. Come to the cabaret. First time I met Peter was in the art theatre and he says, I think I wear more makeup than you do. <laughs> Off the stage, <laughs> lovely eyeliner, beautiful guy. What a what a you know, what a send off. How do you top that? You know, Tommy says it would, it would be great to see you as well. Good down, don't get a, a send off like that. It would take more than four to lift me. But uh, I think I'll uh, I'll be like an eternal flame. I'll get cremated, born forever. <laughs> but uh, what a send off. He'd be up there looking down us, laughing his head off, and really having a ball. What a send off. What a day. Yeah, brilliant. Of course, everybody says just how genuinely nice a guy he was. <laughs> he was just the most genuine guy and uh, just great crack to be with, you know. I was talking to my wife this morning and she says that like, any time she met Peter, they had a ball, ripped the back out of everybody they knew and uh, he was just a great, great guy. I've never experienced anything like it, just to have him here at the top of Ridgeway Street and to be carried by all, all the boys that knew him. Um, Oh, he was just an amazing wee character. He obviously he gave me my 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 start in the game, and uh, I will be forever grateful to this wee man. It's it's his, I don't even know how to describe today. You know, I'm about that far away from you know breaking down, but um, it's gonna. It, a nice send off, that's as much as we can hope for for today. Peter was a real character, um, he was the second director ever in this town to give me a job as a professional actor. Uh, he, was, he was always full of life, a uh, real breath of fresh air, actor, director, writer, raconteur, bon viveur. Um, there was never a dull moment around Peter uh, and he's uh, during the, some of the dark days in this place uh, he was responsible for putting a lot of colour and a lot of life and a lot of entertainment in front of people that might not necessarily have been there.